nobody's safe to go, yeah. you know, to go to top 24. People drown in pools. Very good players drown in pools. They even go 1-2 sometimes. It's but, a treacherous pools of MSM. Yep. Um, but getting into it, Monty versus uh, Frontal Hornet. Demon Watch versus Snake. Um, on town and uh, not town and city. This is Pokemon Stadium too. I'm sorry. Yeah, PS2, uh, the SoCal special. No, no, the Smash Ultimate special. Everybody just goes to PS2 now. Very good neutral stage, and you can kind of see right now Monte playing the dash dance game a little bit more, allowing Snake to have all that space because the C4 is down. Fantastic spot dodge down smash into the forward smash. Wow, what a call out on that uh, C4 uh, explosion with a bucket. Now he has one bucket. Oh wow, just charging that full up smash, not getting a punish, or not getting punish, not punishing Frontal Hornet to try to swallow that away. Now he has two explosions. Bucketed. No, no, he, he he has a full bucket right now. He does? Yeah, he has full bucket. Oh, he does? Wow, okay. Yeah, because I believe the glass counts as two for some reason. And yeah, look at that. The frame two move, insta-kill. And this is really, really hard for Snake just because, yeah, that bucket has a lot of mileage to outdo your grenades. Yeah, and if you can like get a proper read on when they're going to explode, like timing-wise, it's going to be really detrimental um, to your longevity. I mean, 150, it did like so much percent there, it just killed. Oh, tries to up tilt him, but again, gets crossed up by the weird Game Watch dash attack. <laughs> you can just can see I have just, some more? <laughs> he's like, hello, father, may I have, may I have oats? That's so <laughs> funny. <laughs> but anyways, you can kind of see Monte's like movement actually with the bucket. He's doing these B-reverse buckets, oh. but unfortunately overextends and gets up tilt for his troubles. Again, Snake is never out of this. He's able to get the up tilt kills, forward tilt kills, especially you know, Snake's dash attack, kind of good. Mm -hmm. And when I mean kind of good, he's like invincible on his head for some reason. Okay, Monty not going too deep off for that edge guard, just opting for a ledge trap. Uh, back air, sending him back off stage, another chance to edge guard here, going to cover high option, but uh, Frontal able to uh, air dodge out of that upbeat to get back to the ledge. Yeah, fantastic job for Frontal Horna using the down tilt to kind of get him off, but 146%, Monte just trying to look for something, but unfortunately, SD's with that Nikita. Yeah, definitely not what he wanted there. He wanted that upbeat, but got another, and now he has full bucket. I wonder what percent this kills at Nair, up there. This oh. kills now, this kills now. <laughs> it kills now? Yeah. <laughs> oh! You I told you, yeah, I yeah. told you. Why are you cursing people? <laughs> See, this is why we don't, as commentators, are not supposed to say something will kill because Nine times out of ten, it will just kill right after you say it. Hey, you know what? It hey. happens. It happens. Yeah, dude. You can hit him up on Twitter. Pay him $5, <laughs> and we'll get your match on MSM. He'll commentators curse. Free stock. Now, I'll, I'll, I'll literally say, okay, your move, your 0% your crit or thwack will kill, you know? But anyways, getting into game number two, yes. how do you think Pretzel Hornet should play this game now because I feel like he was playing it a little bit too fast. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was setting up with grenades. Yeah, he was setting up with C4. But again, he needs to do these dash dances and get these really good dash dance to kind of catch Monte trying to approach. It's so scary to go for like a C4, especially if Monte gets a read because you see Bucket killing so early. Well, at the same time, you know, playing Snake without C4, without grenades, it's kind of like, okay, what do you have? You have a invincible dash attack, and then you have a few slow tilt options, up tilt mainly being a kill option. But unfortunately, air dodges to his death that SC is going to, you know, prove detrimental. Yeah, that uh, the buffet coming in really threatening there. Oh, he's, oh, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> he's dead. This is so scary. I, oh. This is just like an ominous threat. It's like full waft. It's like rest. Yep. <laughs> I told you he's dead. He bucketed a full charge F smash. Wow. You know what? Frontal Hornet's got it. Almost getting that back throw into um, back throw into C4. But again, Monte just really running away from this. Fantastic parry coming from Frontal Hornet. And then you can't shield grab that. Nope. And up tilt's gonna be able to take it. Wow. Oh. Okay, he has one bucket. <laughs> yeah. It was. Was it? Um. What's What's the count? Uh. What's the uh, vampire from Sesame Street? The oh, count? count Dracula. Yeah, count Dracula. One bucket. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Getting back into this fantastic neutral right now. Front of Hornet, slowing the pace of the game down a little bit more. But you have to be really careful. That C4 basically says no. You cannot be in this area at all. And now Monty, I mean, he's made uh, Hornet respect his uh, bucket timings to um, punish the C4 that it's just so difficult to use your explosive options and incentivize it. But, you know, now he has two buckets and that yeah, smash yeah, to cover he, the roll from ledge. He, he, doesn't, he doesn't need it. So Monte, fantastic job. He wasn't really ledge trapping too, too much. Yeah. Like, he used the bacon a little bit and especially he, you know, caught him with the up smash. Monty, but, sorry, go